then why you not mention volume 1 page 379 if it is correct reference why you put 282 and not 379 i can tell you why cp it is because page 379 in Bari don't have this one ah. Not a true. Hello, everyone, and peace of Christ to all of you. Please invite your friends. And uh, uh, today we are going to go in a funeral. I found that there is a rat, and the rat was in the trap. And it's a very sad moment. Please take a moment of silence. It's just to be remembered. He was a good rat. There is a beautiful moments we need to remember. He is the one who used to say, No CP. We will not hear it no more. No CP. It doesn't say that CP. <laughs> Boy. You know, in China they say he left as a donkey, he never came back as a horse. In our case, he left as a rat, he came back as a rat. Look what this guy is saying, a challenge to CP fans. He's challenging the fans, not me. Man, that's a challenge for you. Oh, hold on. I don't have my screen on. So I have to play the music again now? Hold on, because we are doing this in his memory, and there is no picture of him in the screen. He was very good. His beard is growing. Mimi Hijab, he needs his assistant. Allah, he pray for, not to. I know this is coming. He doesn't speak Hebrew, he doesn't speak Arabic. Silence me. Answer me. <laughs> Allah has parts? Who said so? No CP. <laughs> it doesn't say so. No CP. Well, it's good to remember good things and bad things about people. And here, there's nothing bad about those people. I mean, it's it's. Um, look at this challenge. This Muhammad is saying, and he have a big mouth. Well, it's a mouth of a rat. A challenge to CP fans. Uh, let me try to make it more clear. Hold on. By the way, I don't really go to. I'm not going to his channel. But uh, one of you, he sent me a, a, even a, a, a snapshot of his uh, post. Uh, because I think he will delete it sooner or later. It's like yours. Unable to provide. This quote from Fathil Bari. But surely you can help him. And guess what? The one who take a snapshot, he is the one who look in the internet and he said to me, I'm not even reading your stupid text, you idiot. I mean, you got yourself busted. I mean, it takes you two seconds, if you are a person who knows about religion and you speak Arabic, to find the quote, you donkey. Everybody will die in laughing at you. Just wait, I will show the quote in the screen. Try to find the quote, no CP. It doesn't say that CP in Fathil Bari. And I will take this video down and make a public apology. Okay, we will make a public apology for being what? A donkey or a rat? Please make it clear. Now he have to make a public apology as a rat and as a donkey. Because how you are a Muslim and you have a shelves full of books, those are shelves for what? Do you read them really? Is the book of uh, <laughs> Ibn Hajar in your shelves? 
feel to do so, which he, which you will, and then be aware that your savior incompetent, incompetent. That's a good word, man. That's that heavy duty. That could not get the first paragraph of his book right. Ah, uh, ah, he is calling me an animal. Ah. And this is why Christian Prince he put his picture there in the in the screen. You see the rat in the trap? You see they have too much hatred for me because I'm causing a lot of pain and they went mad and their mad is making them so stupid more and more and more. Now let us see first what this idiot he just did to himself. First of all, you donkey, I was not quoting Fathul Bari. I was quoting different book. And just to show everybody that you, you don't know English, you do not know Arabic. This is my book in Amazon as it is. Anyone can go there. It says here, and he said that here it says uh, Imam Al-Hafiz and Ibn Hajar. First of all, this is a mistake in the editing. Secondly, you will see that I said said. So if I believe there are two, not one person, then why I say that he said said, not they said. All right. Secondly, you said that I am quoting Fath al-Bari because you are a donkey and you do not know how to read. I said quotation from a book that Ibn al-Bari, he said, so, sorry, uh, 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 Ibn al-Hajjar, he said, etc. And this is the name of the, this is the book and this is the page. But you idiot, you did not even look. Ah, maybe you look, but you are a donkey. This is the name of the book. Sharh al Jami is Sagir, volume number one, page number 282. Volume number one, page number 282. So this book is quoting Fath al Bari, donkey. Secondly, you made the challenge that such a thing does not exist in Fath al Bari. And you claim that you are going to make a public apology. If I can provide the quotation, I don't want your apology. I want everybody to ask you why you don't dare to call me. What is missing? Aren't you a man? Look what you said. But surely, surely what? You can help him. Try to find the quote in Fath al-Bari. And I will take this video down and make an, a public apology. I'm saving you now. I don't want you to go and make public apology. I want you to be a man and call me life on air and challenge me, you idiot coward. And this is the reason, actually, you don't dare. Because you in, you are intimidated. No CP, I want to fly to you and debate you face to face. I mean, everybody knows that. I don't. I don't. I'm not. You're not even worth. You see, I'm giving you a chance, an honor, to talk to you. I talk to everybody. I talk even to young Muslims, kids, even you know, very naive ones and every very smart one, educated one. So I will take you with the children's. Call me, be a man. Instead of making a hundred video, they are just a, a bunch of jokes, you know, talking to yourself. And here we go. This is one example, one example of them. If you have a little, little intelligence and little uh, uh, knowledge, you will not make this challenge. Now, let us go to business. Forget about the rat. Is this quotation, quotation exist in Fath al-Bari? Absolutely. But before we go there, This is the book I was quoting from. It's called At Tanweer Sharh al Jami al Sagir. Qala ibn al Arabi. And then he continued here until he arrived. This is my the quotation. Wa qala al Hafiz ibn Hajar. Fi fath al Bari. Qalu kulla man attaqa Allah kana ashadu shahwatan wa a'lama wa a'lama. Etc. So this is the quotation. 
So you see, he is the one caught in the book of Ibn, Ibn Hajar, you idiot. Secondly, you challenge that this quotation does not exist. If we go down here in this book, you will see the quotation. This is the book of Fathul Bari, value number one, page number 379. And for sure, the page number can change, depend in the print. Now, let us show you the book in English, my friend, because now we are showing you in Arabic. I'm going to translate in the front of you. Click translation. Here we go. The translation is not good, you know, I mean, for the name of the book, but who care? This is Google translation. If we go down here, do you see the book of Fath al-Bari, you idiot? It's exactly as my quotation in my page. It says in the book of Al-Hafiz ibn Hajar, he said in his book Fath al-Bari, etc. That you're a prophet he used to do boom boom to his wife all of them the translation here is not uh, you know and he have at that time nine wives so he used to do boom boom to his wife he go around and he boom boom to his wives and there are nine wives all of them in one night or one day or a day you say this is not true here we see the reference Fathul Bari value number one page number th uh, 379 now this is what I quoted but is this book is exist in Fathul Bari absolutely let us show this idiot who brought humiliation to himself if you do tiny search in the internet you will find the text I'm quoting here we go Fathul Bari I mean, why you are stupid? Are you blind? You can't see? Let us use Google translation because here, the problem with those, uh, when you open Google Books, you cannot translate what's inside the, you know, it's like a PDF thing. So let us do this. We will take Google browser and we will translate whatever there. Google translation. Read with me carefully, you idiot. Fathul Bari, fi Sahih al Bukhari, value number six. It says, uh, the translation here, uh, that your prophet was a cruising. Yeah, he's a, you know, he, he have a cruise ship, you know, zzz, on his wives every night, wash, without wash, he's doing them without wash. And they were 11 women. Do you see it? Do you see it, you idiot? He do large intercourse, large number of intercourse. The prophet, he do large number of intercourse. And he was, a, however, he was a cruising on his wife's. This is what uh, uh, this idiot, he was making fun of my accent, supposedly. Uh, he do do brother intercourse. So you are stupid officially. All those references in, in, in Fath al-Bari, you did not see them? And you are saying you will make a public apology? You are a certified donkey. I don't want your apology. It's enough for me that you humiliated yourself. This is the book of Fathul Bari, your donkey. This is what? The book of Fathul Bari, your donkey. I'm not going to call you any name except donkey open and this is the coat you donkey do you see it do you see the page number it's exactly as it is in my book you donkey do you deserve to call you any name after today except donkey we will not call you farid we will, we will call you donkey. I mean, shame on you, stupid. Just before you make this challenge, just go and search. I mean, do you think really somebody will make a book and someone who would like, like, like me, put his reputation 
and like says things do not exist i have the page number i have the book number i have the book name i mean you're stupid and still you could not find it read carefully you idiot ah, i forgot you do not know arabic like your prophet you do not know how to write his name here they are talking about the prophet i will quote even from before my quotation so you, you can get the picture better let us read carefully Oh, I forgot you do not know how to read. It says that from the most amazing miracle, even though he is busy with worshipping his God and his knowledge and dealing with people, and he was tired from, uh, 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 sorry, he was uh, like he, do, uh, he don't eat much and drink much, which make his body weak to be able to F as many. Kuthratu jima. You are lying saying he just visited his wives. And then he says, And even though he used to go around his wives in a night, your brother Farid, he corrected me, he says not every day, in a night, but this is something he do in a day, in a night, or they are the same. Yagsuru in one washing, which means he if his wives one after one without washing, and when he finish, he wash. And they were a living women at that time. And look, you say that did not quote the whole hadith, it's there. And he said, actually, here quoting is saying, and this is what we mentioned before in the book of washing, Kitabul Ghusl. And it said in all of this. Uh, that, uh, that's uh, the one who is very uh, uh, good in worshiping, like he fear Allah, his sexual desire is way more strong because the one who is not fearing Allah, he only can watch, which means he cannot do. I mean, this is not about sex. And this is not the hadith he's asking for. And it's not exist. Here we go. <laughs> the other idiot he said oh he showed us english you idiot i was translating google because people do not use you don't know arabic so i use google translation in the search engine so people they can see what we are talking about idiots idiots like they say in the pink panther idiots oh <laughs> uh, and not only that, actually, here, the whole the whole thing is about sex. Because here, even after that, he says, and, you know, uh, some, like, as an example, Al-Qurtubi, he's saying here, and, and Al-Qurt, hold on, they said that uh, this person, he did not say, this is not his saying, this is what people said. I mean, have you ever heard of a stupid people more than those? It says, it says, it says, this is his, him talking. وقد وقع للنبي صلى الله عليه وسلم من ذلك أبلغ المعجزة. He is he is talking that the prophet it happened to the prophet. This is the amazing miracle. What is the amazing miracle that he can have sex with all those women in one night? He is talking, and then he add at the end he says and they said they said and he continues saying that the one who is fearing Allah. His sexual desire is way more strong. However, just to show you how people are stupid, at the end of the day, he is saying what he heard because you donkey, this guy, he was not in the bedroom of Muhammad to witness. Secondly, whoever saying that, he himself is saying what he heard from your prophet because I'm sure that Muhammad, he don't use to open his camera and people watch, or maybe they are watching from the window of the bedroom. So for sure, this is, he said, she said, they said, they said, but all of this is authentic and even we can find it in Al-Bukhari. If we go to the yellow pages of Muhammad, Al-Bukhari, where is the most, uh, I mean, uh, let us say, embarrassing book, See, because my English is weak, my friend, sometimes I try to find the words. Embarrassing book. Look, this is Al-Bukhari. The liar, he said, it did not say he has sexual intercourse. It says that he had visited them. Read, you idiot. Coward. 
So desperately they try to defend, but we get you busted. What I will tell your mom now, what I will tell your, your daddy and your mommy, that I did spank you and you were not wearing a diaper? How will I explain the situation? They left you as Farid, you turned to be a rat? So like you want to play hero in my back, making videos, supposedly exposing me, be a man calling me, but you cannot. You're a potato, you're a coward. What will happen if you call me? Honestly, what will happen? You will lose your virginity? And all the excuses is a lie because I made a video, I said, though if I hang up on him, I am the one who lost. Did I say, guys, did I say that? Call me. If I hang up on him and or mute anyone who hang up or mute, he is the one who lost. Still, he don't dare. However, don't call no more. It's okay. No problem. I forgive you. I forgive thee. I mean, I thought I thought you are a fart. It turned to be a, di a diarrhea. Diarrhea is a problem. We can deal with the fart. We open the window. But what we would do with diarrhea? And not only that. I mean, you are challenging me to show you the quarter from, from, from Fath al-Bari when I can show it to you from al-Bukhari, you donkey. Stupid. This is in the book of al-Bukhari too. <clears throat> Here we go. All those hadith. And not only that, those books providing to us reference that your prophet, even he don't wash, he wash only once. He do boom boom to all his all his wives, and he do one time wash after he finish, which is an act, action of a pig. Because who in the world when I have sex with all those women in one night, and yet he 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 have only single bath. Hmm. So the challenge was for what? Except your stupidity. As you see, all those hadiths are supporting the same thing. So we found it in Al-Bukhari. We found it in Ibn Hajar. We found it in, 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 in Jami' al-Saghir. And we found that you are a stupid rat. Look how many of them. And not only that, by the way. This book here in the front of us, the one I'm quoting from, it says here, that the Prophet, uh, he have the power of 4,000 men. Why? Because he got the power of 40 men, of people of uh, uh, heaven. And, and each one of the people of heaven have the power of 100 men in earth. And that's mean 40 x 100, that 4,000 men, power for sex. This is what the Muslims are proud about, about their Prophet penis. While the Christians are proud about Jesus healing people, the Muhammadan are proud about the penis of their prophet, and Allah, he promised him that his penis will have the power of 4,000 men. Let us do Google translation so people will not say, and this is from the same book I'm quoting from, page number 282. Look with me. Hmm. Page 282. I will look translate in the front of your eyes. Translate to English. Oh, there's no translation. Or why? Maybe I need to up click here. Okay. Here we go. Hmm. 4,000 men, the power of the horny Muhammad. Praise be to Allah, the God of horn and horny. He will get the power of 40 men, which is equal to the power of 4,000 women men. What kind of religion this religion is? How embarrassing. So look what you did. You embarrassed your prophet because you got him busted. You got the attention from my book and now everybody will go and buy, buy my book, Six and Allah, because people will wonder what kind of book this book are fighting about. In the top of that, you showed us that your religion is a sexual religion, 100%, and this is why I called my book Six and Allah. We call it Six and Allah for a reason. For this is nothing but a sexual book, sexual religion, sexual God. I mean, what? why God want to give Muhammad the power of 4,000 men? What he would do with it? 
what exactly he would do with it okay he got the power of 4000 men now so what he is going to f what 4000 women at least because if a man he can do it only once i mean there are, uh, a man only do it once at least he's a muslim brother muslim can do it more brother <laughs> So if Muhammad, he do it only with, it, uh, uh, let us say, if a normal man, he can have sex at least, uh, let us say, tw twice a day or three three times a day. Muhammad, he will get the power of 4,000 men. That's mean he will get the power, he, he will have sex at 12,000 times a day? I mean, how many seconds that they have? Hold on, let me use my calculator. Calculator. 12,000... Uh, <clears throat> divide in 24 hours your prophet is going to have sex with 500 women an hour your prophet is going to have the power of having sex with 500 women an hour okay hold on if 500 women an hour divide to 60 minutes that's mean your prophet you have eight seconds only to have sex with each one of them. <laughs> Even a rabbit, he cannot do that, man. Eight seconds? Your prophet will have orgasm in eight seconds? Before even he say hi? So look what you did to your prophet. You brought humiliation for yourself. People are laughing at you. And you prove to us again that you are stupid. Is that my fault? No, it's not. I'm not going to stay long. Please don't mention this stupid idiot again to me, please. Don't text me about him. I mean, he's not worth it, as you see. He's just a kid. I feel sorry for him. And, you know, uh, let us take a moment to remember. No CP. It doesn't say that, see? <laughs> I challenge you. I'm going to fly there to humiliate you. I'm coming to you. Do you see my beard, the beard of a goat? Very long beard. Proving knowledge. And now, Christian Prince, he whipped the floor with your beard. If not the bum of Mimi Hijab with it. Al Fatiha. give him some versions. I mean, brother. Okay. Alhamdulillah. Okay, guys, I will be live again in, in uh, I think, in an hour and a half, right? An hour from now? What what time? I'm not sure, like an hour and a half, maybe an hour from now. Yeah. Um, download this video. We will not keep it. It's not worth it. Share it everywhere. Let everybody laugh. And I don't want him to make apology. I mean, apologize to yourself. Apologize to the Muslims for being stupid, and they are being stupid to listen to you. That's your business, not my business. I don't care you make apology, you don't make apology. But I advise you to take and to go and see a doctor because obviously you've been abused. Uh, I'm not talking about child abuse now because you're a man. And don't claim that I did child abuse to you. I never met you before. Okay, I have nothing to do with you. And don't uh, make any uh, statement which is not true. Okay, don't go to mommy and cry and tell them it is the beat me and I did not even touch you. This is internet. You did that to yourself and now you are in the trap and everybody is laughing at you. Shame on you being stupid don't ever even say my name again you are not worth it thank you guys i will be live again and uh, don't forget to download the video all right we will be alive maybe an hour or so check the the second video when it's going to be i think it's going to be uh, around 11 o'clock right something like this yeah anyway uh, so see you again and the video will be uh, why muslims reject and fight islam thank you and god bless you and uh, <clears throat> Uh, please, you can uh, send uh, flowers uh, to...
to the address which uh, our brother will provide for you uh, for remembrance of our brother who by mistake wasn't trapped by the rat trap at he walking down the street la 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 uh, okay anyway take care guys see you soon and this is the christian prince i love you all i love the muslims by the way but those idiots they are just making making fun of you muslims i feel sorry for you those idiots they, are, they have no education they do not know what they are talking about and nothing they say but embarrassing embarrassing to their islam embarrassing to their religion and not only that they give us golden opportunity to expose your false prophet who you are proud about his penis imagine we are proud about jesus making the blind see the death the dead one come to life you know the one who cannot walk walk and the muhammadan are proud about the penis of their prophet and they claim that this is a miracle it's a miracle their god miracle is all about penises and by the way muhammad he could not do it even once this is why he exaggerate about how many times he can do it all those people who have problem especially sexual problem they exaggerate about their power because simply they speak about it because of pain and this is the story of a brother farid he exaggerate in because of pain a lot of pain is caused to him by christian friends if you don't believe me watch me and imagine here just before we continue to our topic we christians we are proud of our jesus who have no sin who make the blind see who told the man who cannot walk carry your bed and walk who forgives sin who made the one who is dead come from the grave who healed the leper and they are proud about the penis of their prophet which is obviously not a true even that is false because in the book of sahih al-bukhari we find that the prophet he don't have sex with his wives in fact he was imagining and if you say that the prophet only in this case he was imagining i have a student or sorry the master of fifi who called me in the other day and the video is there somebody can post it uh, he said that the prophet was not able to do this for 11 or one year why because a jew he made for him 11 knots and took allah 11 month to fix it so for 11 month or one year your prophet was not doing boom boom at least so what women you are talking about and not to forget to mention that your prophet said i was the most weak person between mankind in sexual intercourse and then i invoke my god allah and he sent me a dish of al kufait which is a dish of meat and i ate it and i get the power uh, of 40 men hmm? now we uh, we made a video about it and uh, people they you know they saw it but we can we can mention this again give me a second hold on it doesn't hurt my friend so we can love <laughs> and by the way the book we mentioned uh, it says that the prophet the one i was quoting from uh it says that the prophet have a power of four thousand men don't forget to mention this this is what they are proud about let us see here all right there's many many uh, many books but we will show some of them uh, let me see if I can find. An Islamic website. Here we go. This is an Islamic website. And I will show the, the title. So nobody will say we are making things up. It's taking long to load. Give me a second. Here we go. 
And this is the proof that your prophet, he is unable to have sex. Look what the name of the title, what the title is. Dhukira or Dhikra ma'atiya Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam min quwwati jima'a. Mentioning what the Prophet sallallahu alayhi pray or for him, not to, not to him, uh, uh, from ability of doing boom boom, quwwati jima'a, the ability of sex. And now what I will do, because you do not speak Arabic, it's not my fault, but this is the hadith number, one by one, and this is your Islamic website. Let me show you that this is your Islamic website first. All right, hadithportal.com, hadithportal.com, Jami'u Sunnah wa Shuruhaha, the collection of Sunnah and explaining for it. All right, this is volume number 10, volume number 10. Dhikru ma'atiya, mentioning what is the Prophet he been given as power for sex. Now I'm going to click at Google Translation right in front of your face, so you will see what it says in English, even though you know, Google translation is not really accurate. Translate. Here we go. What is the title, brother? Let us zoom out. <laughs> I mean, what a filthy cult. This is what you are proud about? The private part of your prophet? Guys, do you see, do you see the title? This is Google translation. I have nothing to do with it. Recalling what the messenger of Allah, may Allah pray on him, see prayer on him, and peace upon him was given from the power of intercourse. But what a hero, man. What a hero. The power of intercourse. I mean, he must be amazing prophet. He can do a lot of boom, boom. By, by the way, all is fabricated. Even that is, a, is false. And look, hadith, hadith number 10021. No CP. It doesn't say that CP. We've been told by Muhammad ibn Umar, blah, 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 that the messenger he said, I was the less people in sexual intercourse. He was what? He was what? What? He was the less of the people in sexual intercourse. Okay, how you know, Muhammad, that you are the less people? What does that mean? Your private part will not stand up unless you play the anthem. Even the anthem will not make it move, isn't it? So your prophet himself, he said, he said, not me. He have nothing, nothing. Zzz, hey, hey, come on, move. Zzz, we give him... We give him Viagra, we give him, and look, Allah, he sent him a Viagra, brother. Until Allah, he sent to me, not revealed, he sent to me al kufait And anytime I want it, like right away, fast, like an hour, an hour in the old days is like 15 minutes. So, but I found it right away. Anytime I wish to F women, because his penis is not working, brother, Allah, he sent him the, the kebab. Huh? Now, Go down in the different hadith. Uh, been told by Umar, blah, 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 blah. They said the messenger of Allah, uh, Jibreel came to him and he gave him meat to eat. And I was given the power of 40 men of boom, boom. Do you see it? Do you see it? This is the stupid Google translation. Hmm. Go down. The prophet of uh, Beza upon him said, uh, I mean, the translation is really horrible. That Allah, he sent him a dish of shish kebab, he ate it and he got the power, and any time he needed, Allah, he sent him a dish right away, in an hour, like 15 minutes. Different hadith. Look how many hadith. I mean, look at this. Uh, it says that the Prophet, uh, peace be upon him, he used to go around the night, that's what it's made, uh, 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 to his wives. At that time, they were nine. And when, like, uh, uh, what is this translation? I mean, this translation is horrible. Let me see it in Arabic <laughs> so we can translate this. Okay. So, and he used to go around in the night, and his wife at that time, they were uh, in, uh, nine. Uh, 
and then he uh, uh, like he go from from woman to women. I mean, the translation really is horrible. Let us see hadith number one zero zero two five. Uh, yeah, it's the same actually. You know, it's the same. And the last one is the same too. Like you know, Allah He gave him the power of forty, uh, forty men. You know, forty. I mean, not not thirty nine. Uh, 40, you know, the translation is really horrible. But look, your prophet himself, he confirmed that he was the lowest between mankind in Boom Boom. And this is actually confirmed by the story of Aisha, because Aisha, she confirmed that the prophet he used to imagine himself having Boom Boom. And you tell me, what what is the what is the illness of a man who is imagining that he is having sex with his wives, but in fact he did not. I mean, what is the problem exactly? So all of which we see is about sex. Muhammad, amazing prophet, Allah gave him power, nobody have any witnesses. I mean, how the Muslims even measure that Muhammad, or Muhammad himself, when he say, I get the power of 40 men, how he measure it? Did he have like a... He brought Aisha and he told her, okay, you sleep with me and then you sleep with all those men and let us see who do better. <laughs> Thank you, Christ is Lord, and see you soon again. Bye-bye. Call me right now. Call me right now. Call me right now. Call me. Call me now. Call me now. Go to heaven right now.